Okay, dear students, observe the question. It is from integration, that is the reduction formula for n belongs to capital N if i n is equal to integral sin power n x d x, then i n is equal to minus sin power n x into cos x by x plus n minus 1 by n into i n minus 2. Okay, now we have to prove this question in easy method, that is now proof for this. Take i n is equal to integral sin power n x d x. Okay. Now this can be right. This can be right. i n is equal to integral sin power n minus 1 x into sin x d x. That's all. Now for first one we have to write the differentiation. Differentiation for this one. Differentiation for first one n minus 1 into sin power n minus 2x in the derivative for sin x is cos x and uh, integration for sin x is minus cos x in shortcut way we have to write the differentiation for first function integration for second function so differentiation for this one is n minus 1 into sin power n minus 2x in a derivative sin x uh, in a derivative cos x and uh, integration for sin x is minus cos x now observe the arrow mark this is the best shortcut way now for that i n is equal to now multiply these two that is minus sin power n minus 1 x into cos x minus integral of integral of product of these two integral of product of these two that's why already minus minus to minus to plus n minus 1 is a constant take outside integral of sine power n minus 2x here cos x into cos x is cos square x that's all now from this i n is equal to minus sine power n minus 1 x into cos x plus n minus 1 into integral sin power n minus 2x into cos square x is nothing but 1 minus sin square x d. Right. Now, i n is equal to minus sin power n minus 1x into cos x plus n minus 1 into here multiply with this one sin power n minus 2x minus here minus 2 plus 2 gets cancelled sin power nx dx. Actually we know that i n is equal to sin power nx dx. What about i n minus 1? i n minus 1 is sin power n minus 1 x dx. i n minus 2 is sin power n minus 2 x dx. That's why i n minus 3 is sin power n minus 3 x dx. That's why here i n is equal to minus sin power n minus 1 x into cos x plus n minus 1 into here what we have to write instead of this i n minus 2 instead of this one i n i n that's all that's all now from this i n is equal to minus sine power n minus 1 x into cos x plus multiply with n minus 1 n minus 1 into i n minus 2 minus n minus 1 into i n that's all. Now this one take this side then it is i n plus n minus 1 i n is equal to minus sin power n minus 1 x cos x plus n minus 1 i n minus 2. Are you clear? From these two what we have to take common i n is common then it is 1 plus n minus 1 is equal to minus sin power n minus 1 x into cos x plus n minus 1 into i n minus 2. That's why here 1 1 gets cancelled. Now finally i n is equal to minus sin power n minus 1 x into cos x by n plus n minus 1 by n i n minus 2. That's all. This is easy way. No need to find the integration by parts formula. Directly 
this is the short cut way this is the aramog system right that's all okay